Hey there, Chad Bonja here for High University Libraries. Let's say you have a company and you want to compare your company against others in the same industry in a particular area, maybe in a state. This video shows you how to do that. You can also use information found in this video to create a potential list of clients. For example, if you're looking to sell your product to companies in a particular industry in a particular location, this video shows you how to do that. So what we're going to do is use LexisNexis Academic to find companies by location and create a list and get information about those companies. So here you go. So when we get to LexisNexis, we're going to click on companies. And then because we're going to create a list of competitors or create a list of potential clients or customers, we're going to do this create a company list here. And then we're going to go in and a variety of ways you can search for this depending on what criteria you want to use. If we want to look at for customers or competitors or potential clients, we want to find companies in the same industry. And to do that, you use these NAICS codes. Now, unless you know the NAICS code by heart, you have to use the NAICS code lookup here. And typically what I would do is start browsing. Uh, sometimes the search up here doesn't necessarily work as well as you think it should because you have to actually match the, your terms up with the terms that are available down here. So let's say we're looking for liquor stores. Well, a store is under retail trade. And then liquor would go under basically food and beverage, right? And then here are beer, wine, and liquor stores right there, okay? And then what I typically do will actually drill down as far as I can just to see what's available down there. And generally, I will usually just go ahead and select most ones that are there. And if they broke it down further and it was just liquor stores without beer and wine, we could also just select that and not get the ones of the parent uh, uh, in parents in the hierarchy there. You can also go up here and search for liquor as well. In this case, we would have found the same thing. Uh, but you have to make sure you actually know the words they're using. Otherwise, you may not find anything. So sometimes it may be easier to actually browse. Once you've made your selections, you just click OK. And then we'll go down and it actually puts the next codes in there for us. We'll go down and let's say we're just looking for liquor stores in Ohio. So we'll just do United States here. Do states. Do Ohio. And then create our list. It found us 1,235 companies here. We'll go over here and click next to customize our list. And here's where we can change whatever kind of information we want to have. Um, I'm just going to do... Um, Let's see, I don't really want their ticker symbol because most of these are going to be privately held companies. Um, I don't really want their website or their email address. We don't need their fax number. Um, we know they're in the U.S. We don't need their country. And let's get rid of primary SIC and choose primary NAICS because that's what we originally searched on. Um, and then we can go down and click update our company list. Now, this is going to be sorted by default sort order if we want to. We can sort by city, by sales. Let's just do by city here and then click uh, update company list here. And then there we have our list of companies sorted by alphabetically by cities uh, in Ohio. Mm -hmm. If we wanted to, we can download these selected items to Excel. It'd be a good way to see how many liquor stores there are in each city compared to other cities in Ohio. Uh, to, to once again get a good, good idea as, as your, of your potential competitors or your potential um, uh, customers uh, that you might be reaching out to. So that's how you do this in LexisNexis company dossier. Hopefully this helps you. If you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. I'd be glad to help you any way I can. Take care and have a great day.